Trump addressing the situation, saying it needs to go through Congress to be legal. The president added they have six months to find a solution or he could revisit the issue again. That sentiment of going through Congress is being echoed by Republicans in Austin. As a party, we're glad to see that we're moving away from a presidency that feels like they can do anything they want, they want to do, regardless of whether that's what the law says or not. It's important that we enforce our laws, and if the laws need changing, then that's up to Congress. That's not up to the president. Attorney General Jeff Sessions also said that law was unconstitutional. Executive orders are a power presidents frequently use, and they carry the full force of the law. In his eight years in office, President Obama signed 277 executive orders. That's about 35 a year. President Trump signed 42 in his first 200 days in office. Some of the biggest ones advancing the Dakota Access and Keystone Pipeline, two versions of the travel ban, and one that bans transgender people from joining the military.